This is the Emergency Escape Rating Device or EEBD. It should be done immediately at the first indication of fire or explosion even if the smoke is not visible. You may breathe a fatal amount of carbon monoxide even before the smoke is present. If you suspect an oxygen deficient environment, wear an EEBD. When to use the EEBD? When there is a sight or smell of smoke. When there is a sight of fire. When there are fire or toxic gas alarm. When there is a sudden increase of air temperature. When there's sound or vibration of explosion. When there's accidental release of hazardous materials. And other emergencies. According to SOLAS Regulation Chapter 2-2, only all of ship, EEBD shall be situated ready for use at easily visible places, which can be reached quickly and easily at any time in the event of fire. The location of EEBD shall take into account the layout of the machinery spaces and the number of persons normally working in the spaces. And EEBD shall comply with the fire safety system code. The duration of EEBD is 15 minutes of service in maritime application. However, the duration can be affected by the amount of work required to escape, the person's physical condition, the user's respiration or breathing rate, and the degree of training and familiarity. This is the EBD trainer. We will use it to identify its components. Let us open the trainer one. The EBD is still in a case. Let us remove the latch assembly. Then take out the clear cover. and remove the unit by pulling the yellow strap. When pulled, the activation cable will snap. Here is the closer view of the activation cable. Let us discuss more about the EBD components. This is the cover. The lower part is the base. This is the latch assembly. The nose clip. The mouthpiece. The yellow neck strap. The neck strap ring. The cylinder. The oxygen regulator. This is the activation cable and the blue one is what we call the scrubber this black bag is what we call the breathing bag the S hook in real EBD this is the gauge. Spring clip. And finally, 
the information label. How to done the EEBD? Remove the EEBD from the case. In real emergency, it's the orange case. Remove the latch assembly. Remove the unit by pulling the yellow neck strap upwards. Insert the yellow mouthpiece. Fit the yellow nose clip and inhale through the mouth and skip. For maintenance of EBD, consult your maker's manual. As sample, check it visually for case crack, sign of heat distortion, and many others. It is important to check the pressure gauge if it's still in green zone. If in red, remove from the service. Check the life date and permission label too. Always remember, across the seven seas, Marino matters.